Hey guys, so it's time to do the setup here of the Samsung Galaxy S6. So let's let's do it here, shall we? So I unboxed it, and now it's time to do the setup. So let's pick language. Okay, smart network switch, that's nice. Wow, touch base looks updated. I like that already. I'm gonna set up that Wi-Fi thingy later. I agree. Name, okay. It looks a little bit less annoying here, definitely. Because I've been going through a lot of these menus. Wow, skip. Skip. No, I don't want to have this wake up command later. all. Never, actually. Add fingerprint, wow. Later. all. Easy mode, no. You know. I don't need that. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh, I actually saw the Galaxy S6 Edge in a store. Wow, the notifications looks better. I saw the uh, Galaxy S6 Edge in a store, and I see this like um, this cool thing that they have done with the background. Uh, it has some kind of shadow to it. It looks extremely cool. Let's say, who? Can you see that like little effect? It looks like they made uh, the icons a little bit bigger. Whoa. It's faster. That's for sure. Uh, let's see. Okay. Let's do see the quick toggles here. Okay, settings looks updated as well. Uh, but if we're going to edit, yeah, you have to tap on edit. Seems like actually that they have less things you can toggle and tweak here compared to other Samsung phones. Otherwise, it looks pretty similar to other Android 5.0 devices in here. Uh, but if I go in here, quick settings, some kind of quick settings up here, edit. Okay, that's nice. Wow, you have a lot of options there for the quick settings at the top. Uh, go to about Android 5.0.2, so it's not rocking Android 5.1 at the moment but is probably going to get it or something here in uh, the uh, in the future okay so different app drawer effect there i'm not quite sure if i enjoy those uh transitions i'm not also quite sure if i like the bigger the bigger icons it looks a little bit child more child childlike in a way I can see how they updated some of the apps here. I can see also how the display green looks, has a different kind of tone to it. Uh, let's see, multitasking. Okay, interesting. I like that close all button down there. Wow, went pretty fast there as well to remove things. That's sweet as well. So it seems to be flowing pretty nice here. I have to connect to my Google account, of course. And of course, I do have uh, the camera. Looks really, really smooth here. Really fast focus as well. Oh my God. I really enjoy the camera UI. Looks a little bit more clean. <laughs> That's nice. Let's see, is it smooth? Whoa, oh, does it work in even this way direction? Uh, multitasking, that's kind of cool. I don't think it works like this on other Samsung devices. Okay, let's see how the um, lock screen looks like. You have the, this bubble sound. <laughs> I love it. Uh, so yeah, uh, quick little look here. Let's see how the um, power, okay, it looks pretty similar to other devices. Uh, so definitely let me know if there's anything specific you want to see on this device uh, that I could check out if you want me to compare this phone to, to any other phone. Definitely let me know about that. But just a quick little first look here uh, on the Galaxy S6. Oh, you have that multi window. Wow. I need to check that out. So hopefully you can use more apps in multi window mode on this phone. Uh, compared to older Galaxy devices. Let's hold in here. Okay, so you have this theming option here as well. I had to look into that. Uh, screen grid, so you can quickly change that. That's pretty cool as well. Widgets and wallpapers, those basic things as well. 
so um, oh, touch wheels also looks definitely better, way better. <laughs> the trans transition effects so much better, sharper. So um, yeah, as I said, quick look. Hopefully enjoyed, and uh, let me know what you want to see. And um, yeah, have an awesome day. Peace.